Hi all. I wanted to talk with you about why should it matter if someone calls us ugly or why should it matter if why should it bother us or why why should it upset us? Why should why should our emotions be bothered by the fact that someone calls you ugly or call, so why should it matter if someone calls you ugly or or you look ugly whether you whether you're whether you're slim or big but um the big the, the overweight thing is it's not i'm not really going to be talking about that but with so you know reason being you know ug ugliness is not you know whether it's a benefit or not to be ugly there's no there's no benefit being being there's no benefit being being well there is um, there is a benefit being ugly ugly because at least you find someone that really loves you or cares about you but with that you know like i said in one of my videos just because you're ugly doesn't mean you can dress like a tramp i think you can check that video out or message me if you want to find it or just type in on the search on my search on my channel ugly so what it is is that You know, with the, with the ugliness, you know, you know, you could, you 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 basically sift you sift you sift out the, the 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 person that that's gonna take advantage of you. But you know, saying that anyone can take advantage of you advantage of you, whether you're ugly or not, it's the case of whether you wanna make a better better life for yourself. But with that comes somebody that 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 will will hopefully be decent. That won't take advantage of you, whether be whether be in a friendship, relationship, or whatever. You can sift them out because if if you're if you're, yeah. I, w I will talk about the good looking bit in 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 in, a, in another video. So there is there is much to to be to be to have to be to be to be had or have when you when you're not when you're not good looking when you're not good looking there are benefits and there are disadvantages as well because when you're when when somebody is ugly they 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 would obviously not think they they themselves as worthy to do anything or worthy of anything so yeah but also but it doesn't mean that we should just abuse our lives because we're 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 ugly. If anything, you won't get people bothering you. You won't get if you're a lady, you won't get blokes chasing up after you. Not so many. Not not so many. I would have thought because because of your because 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 you don't look that appealing to the eye. But. But saying all of that, there, uh, how can how can one how can one person define what looks ugly? It's only the media that defines somebody that that's actually ugly. Because the media is only there to make money. Because, yeah. So, 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 and the and the media always dresses up a good-looking person. To make to to show what what their con what their country is like or what the world is like, or what what people should look like, but as human beings, you know, we should we sh we should. What was it now? Because just because the media dresses up dresses up dresses us up. As 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 one person to be to look beautiful, and to look, and to look a, a specific way, doesn't mean that we all should dress like that or be like that. We shouldn't. We should try and we should, we should try gently without, without frustration or upset or, or wanting to. End our lives without, or or, tr or or wanting to end our lives by, by 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 what the media is saying to us. We should. Find our own, find our own identity in Jesus, in Jesus or God. Sorry, I should say mainly Jesus, with God's guidance.
we shouldn't we, we should try not to let 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 the fact that we we look ugly or, or 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 behave in a not an appropriate way we should not let that should we should not let that be our be our identity but in actual fact we should try and see see how Jesus would see it but some will some will say the only problem problem with religion is it causes too many problems but this is not what I'm not I'm not really here to preach religion to you or faith to you I'm just simply giving you the fact the fact giving you the the encouragement that you know don't be bombarded by the by the mere fact that you you might think that you look ugly when when in actual fact there is not really such thing as an ugly person anyway because even if someone looks ugly there is a hidden beauty within them anyway so the mere fact that that person says that that person that 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 told you that you, that you look ugly they they've actually missed miss missed the mark here completely because they haven't really looked properly they just they just blat blatantly labeled the obvious when in actual fact some some supposed man or woman is is meant to look ugly when in actual fact if you look a lot more deeper and look look and keep staring if they, if they will if they will allow you keep staring you and you'll see the the hidden beauty within I'm not talking about a spiritual beauty, but although the Bible speaks about a, God looks at the God look man, man looks on the outward appearance and God looks at the inward appearance. Although that is all vital and true and, and and real, I'm really talking about you know when you look at someone once for the first time, you you think yeah wow they look they're good looking wow they're they're ugly they're so ugly. But in actual fact, if you re if you keep looking after a few days, few weeks, few months, few years, you then start to see something a lot more different about them. As you as you soak in their their beauty, as you soak in and and mem memorize their individual individual parts of their face, you know, eyebrows, eyes, nose, lips, chin, um. The way how the the chin is the chin is formed, the way how the, for, for a man the way how they they cut their how they shave or their hair or no hair, their ears and their smile. But there's no you know there's things like that. But yeah, the smile thing. I'm gonna get that get that video. I'm gonna do that video. Just bear with me. So uh so yeah. Don't don't define someone straight away like that that they that they're ugly. Just give it time for the beauty to sink in because there is be there is real beauty there. Even if there's someone, even if even if you see someone ugly, sometimes when somebody when when somebody's supposed to look ugly, they 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 because they don't they don't have the confidence in their appearance or their beauty, they start to they start to look after themselves in an unhealthy way. Or dress in a certain way that doesn't look appealing to a woman or man. So, you know, yeah, I suppose I'm getting into my other video, my older, my old, one of my old videos. So, yeah, don't don't be beaten down by it, and be 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 happy, be happy in your own skin, be happy in your own mind and body. So. So before I go, let's let's pray. So. Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy that you put upon us from past, present and future. Thank you that you're able to move in our lives from past, present and future, oh God. Thank you that you that you thank you for the message that, you, that you've spoken to us, oh God. Thank you for giving it giving us an, an enlightenment of what, what you truly are, oh God, what you truly are, Lord Jesus. Pray grace and mercy be upon us and be with us and remain with us for, for Forever or, or or until the appointed until until the appointed time, O oh God. I plead blood of Jesus Christ in these situations for healing and restoration in the blood of Jesus Christ. Pray help us to re renew and renew our minds and hearts, O oh God. I pray these things all in Jesus' name. We pray, Amen. So God bless you. Take care. Bye for now. Peace.